Hey Internet, my name is Noni, and welcome uh, to a game, a peculiar game, called Milk Inside a Bag of Milk Inside a Bag of Milk Inside, and you get the idea. Uh, this is a game that I found on Steam for a relatively cheap price. It was um, on sale for 2 ringgit. Uh, original price was 3 ringgit, so, you know, not much. But, I, I don't know much about this game. All I know is that it's pixelated. And it's dialogue base. Um, I did do a tiny bit of gameplay on it. I, I did play a little bit with my friend, and uh, I decided to want to record this. So let's pick English by Nikita Kaf Publishing. Uh, so it's a it's a uh, dialogue based game, point and click dialogue based game, where you talk to your body. Help me buy milk. Okay. Write down my name. My name is No Knee Buds. Alright. Um, I think this one I should use a different voice. I'm on my way to the store, rehearsing the speech. I haven't been out for so long and I've forgotten what words they say when they enter the store. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that noise. I'm on my way to the store. Uh. Who are you talking to? I imagine being a game character. What if, what if it helps to gather my thoughts? What game? Oh, you know. There are games in which you can see the character's thoughts right on the screen, you know. <laughs> so I thought if someone reads my thoughts, I have to be really concentrated so I have to whip up the extra. <laughs> I'm gonna open the lights to scare to scare this shit. <laughs> I'm I'm deeply breathing in. Hello, can I... Damn, I forgot. Damn, bro. <laughs> what a shame. 19th attempt and I'm failing again. I bite my lips with a a a a no annoyance. So once again... Hello, can I get... Wow, a whole bird more. Thank you, I'm trying really hard. In my opinion, this time the I sound was uh, longer than usual. Do you think this is it? Who knows? Hello. Can I? Ugh, I better keep my lips sealed. Huh, don't worry. O okay. By the way, you have been walking with your left foot on asphalt and your right foot on grass for a whole minute. What? It's, it's actually late. It's 11 p.m. I can't scream. My, my right leg froze in the air. Huh, how much? 50 steps on asphalt and 50 on grass. You will have to cancel the previous step. <laughs> how do you imagine it? This is not the first time. You were taught how to do it, come on. I, I don't remember. I'm going to burst into tears. <sighs> From the beginning. So, step one. Take a step back to get your foot exactly into your own trail. Wait, wait. How is it step one? Uh, what then? So, it's already the 52nd. But wait, if I'm going backwards, then 50th. It doesn't. It still doesn't make a lot of sense. <sighs> okay, okay. Step 50th. Take a step back to get your foot exactly in your trail. Could you paraphrase it at least a little? <laughs> God, <you're stupid. laughs> you can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. <sighs> you're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. Well, it is. The store closes in an hour or so. You will be very, very guilty if you do not buy a book. Damn, really? <laughs> so, are you ready? Yes, yes. I gently change the position of the leg, peering carefully into the thick grass. Okay. Oh, this place. I, I remember this. I, I exit it when I get here. <laughs> when I entered the store, I asked the very first person I met. Hello, can I... Oh. 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 Excuse me, what? Who's the left person? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Oh, oh. Excuse me, what? Oh, oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. 
you'd better not to do it. He is clearly not going to change his lines. You run the risk of falling into an endless loop. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me. Oh, come on. Can you just... <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> what? Oh. What is he trying to tell you? He's trying to scare me. But how does he know that I'm terrified of blood of oh. oak? Um. What's so terrible about it? I have a frightening image as soon as I imagine it. I can show. Explaining won't be enough, but keep in mind that I'll cost me a <laughs> <laughs> Get away from me! <laughs> oh god, it still doesn't. Oh. This is this is the kind of horror that it's not like it's a jump scare horror, but it's not like loud. It's subtle. Creeping up to you. <clears throat> Something like that. So I'll just keep on ignoring his question. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. I get the all the will into a fist. Oh. Boom. I punched it. My, inter my interlocutor shook the crowd. You just repeated it after him. And it worked. Do it more often. Wait, I said that he crawled, but did he really crawl? Because I didn't even look in his direction. When exactly did you say that? Yeah, just now. No, you didn't. <laughs> Personally, I did not hear. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. Yeah, you're, you're working out like you know I'm playing the game. I'm standing by the shelves. On the shelves, there are bags of milk. The two of us are standing and... Milk? Lies? Or maybe... Hey, hey, slow down. Do you even remember why you came to buy milk? So buy. Right here? How, in your opinion, should I reply? Hmm, I suppose something like not here. Uh, not here. Take the bag and go to the cash desk. I guess the first sentence. And you'll like for spite. Like for spite didn't make, um, didn't make a pass before the second one. Want to take away all my small victories? I sigh and pull my hand to take milk, or rather a bag of milk inside. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside. Reception, reception! Fifteen minutes before store closing. Hurry up. I remember what these games are called. Visual novels, correct. And by the way, the numbers are written down in full, in letters. Are visual novels worth in books? Not off, but authors are not lazy there, and you don't be lazy too. Wait, I thought only your thoughts were visible on the screen. Not anymore, so what your language? <laughs> <coughs> anyway, you heard me. Hurry up or you'll be no good at home. Already running. I'm scared of this game, honestly. Hello, can I get milk, please? Oh, you have it. Ah, uh -uh. give. I put out a weighty bag at the pay desk. Of course, not just a bag, but milk too. Hello, can I get it back, please? No. Please. No. Please, don't throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. No. But why not? Give more. But I don't have anything else. Hey. What? Uh. Uh. uh pay for milk. <laughs> really? What would I do without you? I pull a crumpled cash out of my pocket and give it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. About two days have passed. What? <laughs> it took this motherfucker two days to read. Uh, Alright, whatever. She nodded satisfactorily and put a cash in the machine. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm walking down the familiar street. I 
past the gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly pulls away my hand, reminding me of the times I took physical therapy. By the way, they gave me a bag at the pay machine, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk inside another bag. Don't get me wrong, I just like the pyramid- <laughs> You're just using big words to make me stumble here, buddy. <clears throat> Let me try this again. I just like the pyramidal structure of verbal constructions. I guess they should get closer. How are you feeling? Thanks for your interest. I feel like a mile of ice cream. What is that supposed to be? As if I tell you. But I'm really interested. Well, look. The ratio of milk to milk and the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1. <laughs> Excuse me, what? Alright, the ratio of water to milk and the volume of air occupied by him. So, milk in volume of air that he has? 30 to 1. I agree, it's not the tastiest ice cream unless you want to drink more than to eat. So the way from the store to the gas station is a stick, and the way from the gas station to home is ice cream. Sure. For today's walk, my body will be in every part of this very simple mass. Okay. I feel movement under my feet, asphalt grains, petrol stains, nice, nice rhymes buddy. I'm trying to keep my balance and how do people move on something as uneven as the urban plane? Neat, heel, sock. I count every meter of the way I've gone. I even close my eyes for more concentration. Abu <laughs> Huh? I unconsciously take a sharp step aside at the same moment a huge bear sweeps past me with a wild ripple. Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> I'm throwing a stumbling peek at the rapidly moving animal. Its red eyes in turn look at me with mockery. Did you see that? How present! It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there are there pairs with eyes on the back of their head? No. You might have died. Come on, are you saying someone will seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? I didn't know it was a girl. Good that my voice is high pitched. The world is cruel and dangerous. I'm not in the world you're talking about. What the hell? Is this like a stoplight or some shit? Looks like it. My path continues. If you think about it, the way from the store has one interesting property. In the most bizarre ways, it adjusts to me. When I hurry, all the traffic lights are serviceably extinguished. When I want to cry, a cloud appears and pours rain flows that, that hide my tears. Right now, I feel how the cloud is slowly gathering over my tongue. I'm sad. Are you sure all this is really happening? And how else? Have you never been visited by the idea that all this is only in your head? The instruction did not say that at all. Apparently these pills don't work on me either. Uh, pills have nothing to do with it. Please, I just want to get home and go to bed. I'm really, really grateful to you. Please, no more. Alright, fine. You know what? What? Since I am the character in the visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading right now. Hey, what's up, bud? Uh, as you say, yes. I squeeze my head with the hands, with the hands, and set a thought block. With the edge of my eye, I notice a small bench, a great place for cliché visual novel monologues. I'm getting closer, putting a noticeably heavy bag of milk nearby and raising my head to the sky. Okay. Oh, hello there. Dot dot dot. Listen, dot dot dot. I'm a little embarrassed. Haha, <laughs> dot dot dot. I understand I'm going crazy. Drugs are working less and less effectively, so. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you understand what I'm talking about? No. Well, I'm not very surprised. I must be quite unlike an exemplary protagonist, right? Do -do -do. To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Same here. Sometimes I regret it, because now I need a lot of effort just to distinguish letters and words. Do -do -do. By the way, do -do -do. if you don't mind, I wouldn't like to say my diagnosis. 
Let at least you be the one who sees me as I am. <sighs> okay, sure. Even if I made you up, don't, don't, don't take it away from me, okay? Don't ask me about it too much. Don't, don't, don't. How stupid is all this? Don't, don't. From the very beginning, you followed me, read my delusional thoughts, heard my stupid conversations. Don't, don't. Maybe I seem crazy and weird to you. Don't, don't. What is it like to see the world with my eyes? Ever since... <coughs> Something happened. I only see red everywhere. Yeah, I can I, I, I see that. No, don't worry about me. I've been used to it for a long time. To be honest, I even forgot what other colors look like. In, in that case, I should be worried. That's not a... That's not a, a, a way for you to say, Ah, this is fine. I can cope with this. You can, dude, that's... Worry. <laughs> Let it go. <laughs> Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all because I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think they're the ones who are scared. Can you imagine it? By the way, if you want to ask me what's happened, please don't. <sighs> yes, I promise. Really? Really? I'm serious. Of course you could not to ask. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have raised this topic. So you're really wondering what happened to me? Not really. I mean, if it's traumatic, you don't need to say. I won't take time. What do you see? Uh, oof, well, <laughs> this, this is interesting. Okay, I think I see uh, milk inside a... Oh, okay. Um, I feel like I see birds. Are you sure? One way or another, this is my. What? Some of his parts, at least. We do have a very difficult family, but despite all the problems, I would never have thought. Sorry, I should have raised my voice. In general, threw himself out of the window and died. This is my last memory. Then, a long gap. Oh. Strange. Very strange. But, uh, today is the first time I've been able to buy something from the store without a serious incident. Of course, the medicine helped me. However, I think it's more of your merit. I was thinking all the time. Do not screw up in front of the reader. Or... Oh my god, what will he think? <laughs> I don't know why I decided to become a character in a visual novel for the sake of going to the store today. But it clearly bore fruit. Thank you! Da -da -da. By the way, da -da -da. I think there are some frameworks in our communication. Da -da -da. Oh, that's how I like it. <laughs> oh, yeah, that, that is nice. We got rid of the framework. And yet, I'm so sad lately. I think more and more about what my life has become ever since my dad. Well, you understand. Day after day is the same. I've tried so many pills that I can't feel the difference between them anymore. As long as they keep me on my feet, I'm happy. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. But you know what? Today is a special day because I have you. I want to tell you. Uh, 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 I, dude, I was having a pleasant conversation. I was, I was, I, 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 I why? No, no, no. It was very rude of you. Oh no. I will not press you. I just advise you. Go home. Da, da, da. I understand. Well, dear reader, Yikuzo? I was so rude! I was so invested! I stopped on my floor and hang by the railing, repeating this action every day like a ritual. I stopped being afraid of heights. A few minutes ago, the pills finally came to naught, so I'm just enjoying blissful silence. When I am under the influence,
influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head, mixing with the sounds of the world around me. They create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. That's a, that's a scary apartment. <laughs> Son of a fucking... Did you break milk? Oh. Hi, mom. Oh, that's mom. Did you break milk? Yes, mom. Did your new medicine help? Yes, mom. <laughs> Go to bed. Yes, mom. I hate that. I hate, I hate that. Oh my god. Oh, milk pot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fine. Jeez. Whatever. Well, I'm gonna stop it right there. That was milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk, and you get it. So, didn't expect the game to actually have a like very deep meaning. I thought it was just gonna be a random horror game. Uh, gonna have to put like a, a a little bit of disclaimer at the start of the video then, cause so here's what I think about the game, right? The game's clearly about like this girl who's dealing with I guess depression, because clearly pills, you know. Uh, Whatever pills it is, you know, her, her dad died, it's kind of, it, it is a tragedy. And obviously trauma from, you know, losing a, a close one is really hard to get over. Obviously she took um, a path, it's, I, we, we can't really say if it's wrong or good, it's just a path, right? That she wanted to take pills so that she'll be, feel better. Uh, still, the mom... I hate that. Oh god. Oh, there's so much I wanna research about this game. I know there's probably like more endings because again, like the character said, it's a visual novel. But it seems like the voice in the head, the the one I was narrating, what was it? The when when they were walking, right? I was narrating the deep voice one. I feel like that's just trauma trying to uh, uh, the voices from the pills telling our character here what to do i don't even know her name but oh god that game freaked me half to death because it's it's creepy it's not scary like you know if you play slender right of course slender is scary but once you see slender it's just run and don't get caught this game is i don't know when anything's gonna happen I just wanted to talk to our character and the fucking voices interrupt me. I was having such a pleasant conversation. But anyways, um, I will link this game in the description. This game is, as you can see, very, very interesting. I will not go through the others because uh, I'm a big whippy baby. But it's very cheap and I recommend you try it. You know, it's definitely worth it for the price. Like a very small game for a very small price. So I hope you all enjoyed this. I still... Um, not bad because I am currently in the second week of my third semester and things are picking up ske speed so maybe I'll just upload like once here and there but without further ado I hope you all enjoyed that and I will see you all um, next time see you guys